Sharice, we've heard a lot recently about the various strains of COVID, including here in the metro area. And now the CDC is projecting the highly contagious British variant will be the dominant strain in the U.S. by mid-March. And as Tan Trung reports, that is raising concern that yet another surge of cases is looming in Louisiana. As many of us wait for our doses of the COVID vaccine, this is a dose of reality. State health officials predict Louisiana will endure a fourth surge in cases before we can reach herd immunity. And I think people need to be prepared for that. This variant is more transmissible. It's, it's possibly more virulent. Dr. Joseph Cantor is talking about the so-called UK variant of the coronavirus, which the CDC predicts will be the main strain in the country within weeks. So far, there are five confirmed cases in Louisiana. 20 are pending confirmation by the CDC. Even though I can tell you there's five confirmed and 20 pending confirmation in the state, without doubt, there are many, many more variant cases in the state that we just don't know about. They don't know about those cases because outside of the CDC, there's not enough genomic sequencing of the coronavirus happening in the U.S. That work can identify mutations in the virus. So far, uh, it hasn't changed enough that it would endanger the efficacy of vaccines. Uh, but so far. So far. Well, the, uh, there are 19 at least emerging clads of SARS-CoV-2 that have been detected. The clads Dr. Lucio Mila is referring to are the variants, like the UK and South African ones we've heard so much about. Dr. Mila and his colleagues at the genetics department at LSU Health Sciences in New Orleans redirected their work to sequence the virus. They're hoping to partner with the state to get a better grasp on variants spread in Louisiana. Dr. Mila says it's likely the vaccines will have to be modified to protect from current and future mutations, which he says could be done relatively fast. It would probably take weeks rather than months to, uh, uh, but then yes, then you would have to uh, manufacture and distribute the new vaccine. As we're already seeing, distribution of vaccines can be bumpy. So the message of masking and social distancing remains one of the few predictable aspects of this pandemic, which keeps presenting new dilemmas. Tan Trung, Eyewitness News. And while state officials acknowledge the need for genomic sequencing and the tracking of COVID variants, there is no timetable for when that kind of work could be expanded in Louisiana.